Welcome to Key Tech. Please describe this channel if you are interesting in today's video. The Kirin 9000S processor installed in Huawei's Mate 60 Pro mobile phone has once again attracted public attention to domestic chip manufacturing. Although the manufacturing status of the chip has not yet been clarified, this does not prevent people from eagerly anticipating the domestic 7nm chip. However, is it feasible to produce domestic 7nm chips without EUV lithography machines? This issue has been discussed many times. In fact, several of the DUV lithography machines currently launched by ASML can realize the 7nm chip process. They are realized through multiple exposure technology. This article will introduce three methods that can manufacture 7nm chips without EUV lithography machines and analyze their advantages and disadvantages. Three methods of manufacturing 7nm chips under multiple exposure technology. 1.LEAL Layered Etching and Layered Exposure Technology LEAL technology splits the original one-layer circuit into several layers for photolithography. Even using a DUV photolithography machine, the 7nm process can be achieved. The advantage of this method is that it can improve accuracy through multiple photolithography operations, but it also brings some challenges. First of all, LEAL technology has higher requirements for etching, deposition, and other processes. At the same time, the precision requirements for the workbench are also very high, and it is necessary to ensure that there is no offset during multiple alignments. In addition, LEAL technology will lead to a decrease in chip yield because multiple exposures will increase errors thereby affecting chip quality and yield. In addition, multiple exposures will double the photolithography time, thereby reducing manufacturing efficiency and increasing costs. 2.LFLE Layered Frozen Lithographoid Layered Exposure Technology LFLE technology is similar to LEAL technology in that it splits the original one-layer circuit into multiple layers for photolithography. The difference is that LFLE technology performs photolithography again on the first layer of photoresist that has been chemically frozen but not removed, creating twice the structure. This method is more complex than LEAL technology because it requires more precise control of the chemical freezing process of the photoresist. LFLE technology also faces yield and cost issues, but compared to LEAL technology, it has higher process requirements. 3.SAP Side Wall Pattern Transfer Technology SAP technology is different from the first two technologies in that it uses deposition and etching technology to improve the accuracy of photolithography. SAP technology forms the side wall pattern of the chip by depositing a thin film on the photoresist and then etching it. Compared with LEAL and LFLE technology, SAP technology is more flexible and can adapt to different process requirements. However, SAP technology also faces the problems of high process requirements and increased costs. Limitations and Challenges of Multiple Exposure Technology Although multiple exposure technologies can achieve 7nm chip manufacturing without EUV lithography machines, they also have some limitations and challenges. First, these technologies have higher requirements for etching, deposition, and other processes, requiring more precise control and operation, thus increasing the complexity and difficulty of manufacturing. At the same time, 
multiple exposure technology needs to ensure no offset during multiple alignments, which places higher requirements on the accuracy and stability of the workbench. Secondly, multiple exposures will reduce the yield of the chip. After all, each exposure will introduce a certain error. In addition, multiple exposures will also reduce manufacturing efficiency and increase costs. Therefore, multiple exposure techniques are generally not considered for chip manufacturing unless there are no other options. Why China Need EUV Lithography Machine Although multiple exposure technology can meet the current 7NM process needs, to enter the 5NM stage, EUV lithography machines must be used. This is because the DUV lithography machine has limited accuracy and cannot perform unlimited multiple exposures. According to professionals, the current TUV lithography technology can only perform up to four exposures and can only reach a process level of 7 nm at most. Therefore, to achieve higher level processes, such as 5 nm, more advanced EUV lithography machines must be used. Although there is no EUV lithography machine, China still has multiple exposure technology as an option for manufacturing 7NM chips. Although the three methods, LEAL, LFLE and SAP, have certain limitations and challenges, they are still feasible solutions under certain circumstances. However, as processes continue to advance, EUV lithography machines will become necessary to achieve high-level processes. As an important part of the chip manufacturing field, the development of photolithography technology is bound to further promote the development and breakthrough of domestic chips. In my personal opinion, localized chip manufacturing is an important part of the development of China's information industry. Although there is currently a lack of EUV lithography machines, the manufacturing of 7NM chips can still be achieved through multiple exposure technology. This not only demonstrates the technical strength of China's chip manufacturing field, but also provides strong support for domestic chips to compete in the market. However, China still needs to increase research and development and investment in lithography technology and strive to achieve the localization of EUV lithography technology as soon as possible to promote the further development of China's chip manufacturing industry. Only on the basis of independent research and development and innovation can we achieve control over chip technology and enhance China's position in the global chip industry chain. China has reason to believe that through continued efforts and cooperation, China's chip manufacturing industry will be able to usher in a better future. If you agree with the views of this video, Please like it, welcome to repost, leave a message and share it.